good morning children now let us start with the new chapter introduction to java and blue jay now before starting blue jay let us understand few terms what is a language language is a mean of communication language is the normal way humans communicate only human use language human language has syntax a set of rules for connecting words together to make statements and questions now if we ask what is a programming language so programming language is a set of codes or instructions used to communicate with the machine so programming language allow us to give instructions to a computer in a language that computer understands now when we are giving instructions to the computer computer understands only machine language whereas we understand high level language that is high level language is in human readable form that is written in simple english language so computer doesn't understand english or any high level language computer understands only machine language so that is why the instructions which we give to the computer are translated into machine language you know that machine language is the language which is made up of two digits that is 0 and 1 now next is syntax in computer programming means the rules that control the structure of the symbols punctuation and words of a programming language if the syntax of a language is not followed the code will not be understood by a compiler or interpreter for example if a user tries to execute a command without proper syntax it generates syntax syntax error so usually causing the program to fail so that is why the syntax is very important while writing any in any of the programming language next is types of languages when we create a program we write it using some kind of computer language so there are two types of languages high level and low level language high level language is the language which is written in simple english language and which is in human readable form so the term programming language usually refers to the high level languages such as basic c c++ java etc now high level language are simple languages now in this we use english and mathematical symbols like plus minus percentage division etc for its program constructions so java is the most popular programming languages used for building server side applications to video games and mobile apps now next is your low level language low level language is also of two types machine language and assembly language so low level it does not need any translator program why it doesn't need any translator program because it if a program is written in machine language it can be executed directly whereas if a program is written in high level language it so it has to be converted into machine language so we also call it machine code as it is written written uh, written as uh, strings of zeros and ones so low level code is often not human human readable we can't uh, get to know the by reading the code of machine that what it what does it mean so machine language is the only language that is directly understood by the computer now next is a program now computer we say that it is a versatile machine it is being used almost in every field banks offices railways schools in design designing animation games etc so what do you think computer performs all these tasks task on its own the answer is surely no 
why because computer also needs some instructions so that is called programs so these programs are then translated into machine codes by translators so there are two types of program source program and object program source program is a set of instructions called program developed by a programmer using any high level language like java c++ which is easily readable or understood by human being whereas object program refers to machine executable program translated after compilation of a source program using compiler now a programmer a program written by a programmer in c++ language is called a source program so rather in any language whether i write a program in c++ java basic any of these languages that is that will be called as a source program so if we take an example of c++ so it will be having dot cpp extension so dot cpp extension is given to the source program so when this program is translated into object program or machine code then the extension given to that program is dot obj so dot cpp refers to the c++ source file and dot obj refers to an object program file so the language which we use to write instructions is called programming language and the person who writes this program is known as programmer now coming to the next topic that is introduction to java java is a popular high level programming language it is an object oriented programming language originally developed by sun microsystems the java programming language is machine independent language which means that a java program written on a computer will run on any computer even if the operating system is different java runs on a variety of platform here platform means operating system such as windows mac operating system unix windows xp etc uh, if we take an example that if a program written in c or c++ language which are not platform independent so the compiler generates an exe file exe file is your executable file which is operating system dependent so when we try to run this exe file on another operating system it does not run since it is operating system dependent and hence it is not compatible with the other operating system whereas java language is in java language java language program java program can run on any of the operating system so whether it is windows windows xp whether it is unix or uh, um, linux anything so be why because of its byte code so byte code we will discuss in the next class now n n the other is that where it is used it is used in mobile applications especially for android apps desktop applications web applications web servers and application server most of the games are also developed in, in java language now i am giving you the two three questions which you have to do it in your notebook so we will meet in the next class with few other topics thank you children